How's it going? I'm Parable. Insurgency Sandstorm is coming to console, so I know there's a lot of new players looking into playing. First and foremost, I make videos on hardcore tactical shooters, and Insurgency Sandstorm is a hardcore tactical shooter. Every gun in this game is a one shot to the head. And taking out a whole squad is easy. But getting one tapped is also just as easy. To start, I would recommend playing local play. Try out some guns. Kill some bots. Die to a bot. And I can say with absolute certainty, there will be no aim assist on console in Insurgency Sandstorm. So if you play games like Rainbow Six Siege or PUBG on console, you might be used to no aim assist. But if you come from Call of Duty, good luck. Because some of the guns in this game have a lot of recoil. Which is great, making it a more skill based game. So use guns with less recoil at first and work your way to the more heavy hitters. There are two teams security and insurgents. Each team has unique weapons and equipment. When creating a class, you only have a certain amount of points to spend. Everything in your class costs points. Your gun, the attachments, even the equipment. So you have to balance your gear. So you could have the best gun and the best attachments, but wouldn't have points for equipment or even for a secondary. On security, the rifleman class M16A4 costs two points. Add one of the one point optics, either hollow, MRO or red dot and already you got a great mid-range weapon for three points. And it's manageable close range. I add an aiming grip and a flat top all together making the weapon seven points for one of the easiest guns to use starting out on security. On the Insurgency Rifleman class, I would recommend the AKM with the 1.5 PKAS scope. So 4 points for a pretty easy to use full auto AR. Although the AK has a little recoil, it's easy to manage after some practice. Always use a pistol and don't be afraid to switch to it. Handguns on this game are easy to use and they will drop someone fast. And some pistols cost zero points. When reloading, you can quick reload, which drops your current mag on the ground by double tapping R, or on Xbox, double tapping X, or on PlayStation, double tapping Square. If you use all the ammo in your mag, always quick reload. An empty mag isn't doing anything in your inventory. Plus you get that slight boost in reload speed. So always quick reload when empty. 
Also, the reload animation stops where you left off if you cancel it. So if you start a reload and then sprint, after stopping, your gun will have no mag. So make sure you finish the reload before sprinting. Single tapping is very strong in this game. That's another reason I like the M16A4 on the security. It's easy to control the recoil while single tapping, and follow-up shots can be quick and accurate. So don't be afraid to put your gun on single fire. And don't forget, switching to your pistol is faster than reloading. If you enjoyed, consider subscribing and hitting the bell so you know when I post a new video. Also, comment down below if you play or plan on playing Insurgency Sandstorm, either on PC or console.